People are saying the Giga Factory in Mexico has been canceled. It has not. Is Tesla canceling the Giga Factory in India? Possibly, I don't that was never even a thing. They may or may not, but the Giga Factory in Mexico, it is 100% going ahead. Elon Musk has been stirring up discussions about Tesla's upcoming models in Tesla Q1 2024. The company is accelerating its timeline for new product, which potentially includes Model Y Juniper releases. Tesla aims to introduce them well ahead of the previously anticipated start of production by the latter half of 2025. The highly anticipated Model Y Juniper is on everyone's radar, especially since it's currently the world's best-selling model, but still has room for improvements that customers are eagerly awaiting. So, what design enhancements can we expect from the Model Y Juniper, including both exterior and interior? How will this EV's power improved? And how will it surpass the current Model Y and its competitors? Stay tuned as we delve into these details in today's video. What exterior updates are coming to the Model Y Juniper? 1. How will Model Y Juniper's enhanced camera features improve driving safety? Model Y Juniper is poised to deliver advanced camera capabilities. Tesla's innovative approach to camera integration goes beyond the standard front-facing camera for autopilot features. The front camera on the Model I supports autonomous driving features with resolutions typically ranging from HD 1280x720 to Full HD 1920x1080. In the future, Tesla may improve and add new features to the Model Y Juniper, which may include increasing the number of cameras or integrating more advanced technologies. Beyond the eight cameras in old Model Y, Tesla may equip the Juniper with up to 10 or even 12 additional cameras, including rear, side and overhead cameras, supporting features like blind spot alerts and a 360-degree view system. These supplementary cameras are poised to provide more accurate environmental information and enhance the autonomous driving experience. In other Tesla models like the Model 3 and Model S, they are typically equipped with 8 to 9 cameras to support self-driving and safety features. Tesla's competitors, including BMW and Mercedes-Benz, also incorporate advanced camera systems for autonomous driving and safety across several specific models. BMW utilizes advanced cameras in models like the 5 Series, 7 Series and X5 to support features such as Lane Keeping Assist, Adaptive Cruise Control and Pedestrian Detection. Similarly, Mercedes-Benz integrates sophisticated camera technology into vehicles like the E-Class, S-Class and GLE, contributing to intelligent driving assistance systems with features like automatic emergency braking and active lane change assist. 2. What convenience does the power frunk bring to the Model Y Juniper? The front trunk frunk of the Tesla. Model Y Juniper is anticipated to feature power operation, providing convenient access to the front storage area. Currently, the standard Tesla Model Y does not come equipped with a power frunk and requires manual opening and closing. So many customers has been hoping for this update. The frunk on the Tesla Model Y serves as a practical storage space at the front of the vehicle. Its dimensions vary across different versions of the Model Y, typically offering a volume of approximately 1.0 to 1.5 cubic meters, equivalent to 36, 53 cubic feet with dimensions ranging from about 85, 93 centimeters in length, 100, 110 centimeters in width, and 20, 30 centimeters in height. The addition of power support for the frunk on the Model Y Juniper is expected to enhance user experience significantly. This electric assistance feature may include the ability to open the frunk with a single button, press on the vehicle's control screen or remote key, Automatic opening and closing mechanisms reduce user effort and streamline access to the front storage area. Several electric and competitor vehicles on the market feature power frunk capabilities to improve user convenience, such as Ford Mustang Mach-E, Audi e-tron, Porsche Taycan, etc. We would say Tesla obviously cannot let Model Y Juniper lose in this battle. What about you? Do you think this power frunk feature is needed? Or you are completely okay with a Model Y Juniper with a normal frunk? 3. K 
can blind spot warning lights on the Model Y Juniper Enhanced Driver. Awareness? This safety feature is designed to enhance observation and detect vehicles passing through the driver's blind spot, but is not standard on the current Tesla Model Y. Model Y Juniper will be the next model that Tesla's fan put trust on to have this feature. Typically integrated into the exterior side mirrors, these lights act as a driver assist alert system. These lights illuminate or flash to draw the driver's attention to potential blind spot hazards. Tesla has not introduced this feature on any of its models, including the old Model Y. However, Tesla's dedication to safety and ongoing enhancement of autonomous driving features indicates that upcoming models like the Model Y Juniper are likely to integrate this technology in response to user preferences for increased safety. Competitors like Audi with the e-tron, BMW with the iX3, and Mercedes-Benz with the EQC have integrated blind spot warning lights into their side mirrors, highlighting the safety and convenience of these electric vehicles. 4. How will the Adaptive Air Suspension System elevate the Model Y Juniper's performance? The highly anticipated Model Y Juniper is expected to introduce an adaptive air suspension system, a feature that many enthusiasts have eagerly awaited. In its earlier iterations, the Tesla Model Y was not equipped with an air suspension system. Instead, it utilized a traditional coilover suspension with springs and shock absorbers. While effective in controlling and stabilizing the vehicle on the road, this setup lacked the flexibility and adaptability that drivers desire. The desire for innovation stems from the flexibility and adaptability that an air suspension system offers. The anticipated air suspension system for the Tesla Model Y Juniper will offer automatic ride height adjustments, configurable for different driving modes such as Sport Mode or Energy Saving Modi. Ride height adjustments typically range from approximately 120 mm to 200 mm, depending on the selected driving mode, allowing the vehicle to tackle terrain challenges and perform well on various road surfaces. Comparing this to other Tesla models, like the Model S and Model X, which already feature adaptive air suspension, adding this feature to the Model Y Juniper will expand options and improve the driving experience for users. Furthermore, when comparing with competitors like the Audi e-tron, Jaguar I-Pace and Mercedes-Benz EQC, all of which are equipped with air suspension systems, Tesla's integration of adaptive air suspension into the Model Y Juniper will enhance its competitiveness in the electric SUV segment. 5. What impact will darker wheel options have on the Model Y Juniper's aesthetic appeal? Model Y Juniper will probably also include introducing new wheel cover designs, possibly offering darker options for the 19-inch stock Gemini wheels. These updates aim to give the Model Y Juniper a fresh and distinct appearance on the road, aligning with Tesla's commitment to continuous innovation and style. In the automotive industry, darker wheel colors can range from shades like graphite, gunmetal, or matte black. These colors are popular among manufacturers because they complement a wide range of vehicle exterior colors and give a more sporty or sophisticated appearance. Several luxury and performance car brands offer dark colored wheels as part of their optional packages or standard features. For example, Audi provides black optics wheels on models like the Audi A4, A6 and Q5. BMW offers jet black or orbit grey wheels across their lineup, including the 3 Series, 5 Series and X5. Considering this trend, what type of wheel colour would you prefer for the Model Y Juniper? Your feedback could influence Tesla's design decisions and enhance the overall appeal of the vehicle. What about interior? What exciting interior updates are coming to the Model Y Juniper? Tesla has followed a pattern of annual updates to its models, refining features and technologies to keep pace with advancements in the industry. Now, as Tesla has just launched Model 3 Ludicrous and had been prepared for the launch of the Model Y Juniper in 2025, an incremental refresh is anticipated to precede this release, heralding three key upgrades, interior refresh, screen updates, and seat improvements. Interior refresh. One significant aspect of this refresh will involve interior enhancements, including the removal of decorative wood trim and its replacement with soft fabric materials. 
This shows that Tesla is on track for 2024, as reports from publications like Automotive News and Design News have highlighted a growing preference for eco-friendly materials and cleaner interior aesthetics in the industry. Luxury car manufacturers such as BMW and Audi have also embraced similar design philosophies in their mid-range and luxury vehicle segments, such as the BMW i4, BMW 3 Series and BMW 4 Series or Audi A4 and Audi A5. One notable upgrade in the Model Y Juniper involves the enhancement of the lighting system. Currently, the Model Y's lighting system provides functional illumination throughout the interior, but lacks the RGB, red, green, blue, color control, and ambient lighting effects. Thus, if this system is upgraded, it is likely that we will see the Model Y Juniper version with the RGB ambient lighting system will likely be integrated into various parts of the cabin in Model Y Juniper, such as footwells, door panels, and dashboard accents. A standout feature could be the redesigned steering wheel, potentially inspired by Tesla's semi-truck, with the option for a wired control system. Furthermore, upgraded audio system and a rear screen can significantly enhance the driving experience. We have been scrolling through Tesla enthusiast forums. There have been numerous discussions expressing hopes for improvements in the audio system of the Model Y Juniper, including increasing speaker count, enhancing sound quality, and incorporating advanced audio processing technology. This may stem from the recent upgrades of the Model 3 performance, featuring a 14-speaker Harman Kardon sound system. Similarly, the Model S features a premium audio setup with 22 speakers and 960 watts of power. What about you? Are there any specific audio upgrades you would like to see? Feel free to share your thoughts. Screen updates. The center touchscreen will receive an upgrade with the latest AMD Ryzen chip. The Ryzen chip features advanced processing capabilities, including a quad-core CPU central processing unit with high clock speeds and an integrated GPU graphics processing unit based on AMD's RDNA 2 architecture. Compared to previous Tesla touchscreen systems, the AMD Ryzen chip offers approximately 2.5 times the CPU performance and up to 50% faster GPU performance. The Ryzen chip in the Model Y Juniper leads to faster response times, smoother animations and improved graphics rendering on the touchscreen. Its architecture features four CPU cores and eight threads for efficient multitasking ensuring seamless navigation through menus and applications. Users will experience enhanced responsiveness and fluid interaction, even with multiple tasks running. Additionally, the Model Y Juniper's rear screen could offer enhanced entertainment options for rear passengers. Tesla may introduce a larger, advanced display ranging from 8 to 10 inches, providing a clearer viewing experience. The Model Y Juniper's rear screen enhancements could align with user preferences and community feedback, potentially influencing Tesla's considerations for upgrades. This trend has been observed in recent Tesla models, such as the Model 3 and Model S, which received notable improvements based on user desires. Seat Improvements One notable improvement in the Model Y Juniper is its seating upgrades. In response to customer preferences, Tesla may introduce vegan leather seats in the Model Y Juniper, which offer a softer feel and detailed stitching with two color choice of black and white. White color choice has not been favored by many customers in previous models due to its susceptibility to dirt and stains. To accommodate these preferences, Tesla continues to offer black interior options, providing customers with choices that suit their needs and lifestyle. Additionally, the driver's seat is being redesigned to be thicker and more ergonomic, reducing fatigue during long drives. The driver's seat in the Model Y currently has a thickness of approximately 2 inches. With the planned upgrade to be thicker and more ergonomic, the seat is expected to increase to about 3 inches in thickness. This increase in seat thickness for enhanced comfort and ergonomics has been observed in luxury vehicles like the BMW X3 where the seat padding thickness ranges from 2.4 to 3.1 inches. Tesla's plan to incorporate ventilated seats into the Modelli Juniper brings a unique aspect to this feature. Tesla's approach is likely to provide more effective cooling and airflow distribution across the seat surface, enhancing overall comfort during hot weather conditions. 
This innovative design contrasts with typical ventilated seats in luxury vehicles like the BMW X3 or Audi Q5, which may provide airflow through perforations in the leather. Tesla's system is expected to be more efficient and comfortable due to its advanced technology and ergonomic considerations. Furthermore, the Model Y's cargo capacity is impressive, reaching up to 2,158 litres when the rear seats are folded flat. For added versatility, the Model Y is known for its seven-seat configuration by folding up the rear seats. With the Model Y Juniper, there's a high likelihood of an additional seat in the rear row, potentially offering a 7 plus 1 seating arrangement. While this concept isn't entirely new in the automotive industry, it would be a first for Tesla's Model Y lineup. The introduction of a 7 plus 1 seating layout aims to enhance the vehicle's versatility and appeal to families and larger groups. By increasing the seating capacity, the Model Y Juniper can accommodate more passengers comfortably making it suitable for various travel scenarios. Some users may appreciate the added flexibility and practicality of the expanded seating, while others might prioritize a more spacious cargo area. If it were you, which would you choose? When will this highly anticipated vehicle hit the market? In a recent earnings call, Elon Musk discussed Tesla's ambitious plans for new model production, targeting over 3 million vehicles by 2025. Musk indicated a potential acceleration of new model production to early 2025, if not late this year, which is earlier than previously anticipated, with initial plans slated for the second half of 2025. Regarding the Model Y Juniper, Tesla's 2024 production schedule outlines a start of production in October 2024, with deliveries expected by the end of that year. In power aspect, how is Tesla advancing battery technology for the Model Y Juniper to enhance range and efficiency. The 2170 round cell battery, which is used in Tesla's recent variants of the Model Y, faces challenges primarily related to energy density and performance optimization. Model Y's upgraded rear-wheel drive version can achieve an extended range of up to 455 kilometers, about 282 miles, per charge, utilizing the 2170 round cell battery similar to the all-wheel drive models. The 2170 round cell batteries, while effective in delivering range and performance, have limitations in terms of energy density compared to newer battery technologies. These batteries may have an energy density of around 250 watt-hour per kilogram to 300 watt-hour per kilogram. Therefore, Tesla's upcoming Model Y Juniper is poised to revolutionize electric vehicle battery technology with three potential battery configurations. 1. 4680 battery cells. Tesla is eyeing Panasonic's new 4680 battery cells, designed to deliver higher energy density, operating range and power. Newer battery technologies such as the 4680 cells aim to significantly improve energy density, with targets set at around 400 watt-hour per kilogram or higher, and an impressive driving range of up to 400 miles for the Model Y Juniper. Discussions also revolve around the possibility of a 350 kilowatt charging input, achievable with higher voltages exceeding 800 volts. Tesla indicated that the 4680 cells can provide up to a 16% increase in energy capacity and significant cost reduction compared to previous battery technology. These rumors hint at exciting advancements for the Model Y Juniper, this groundbreaking 4680 battery technology offers numerous benefits to vehicles utilizing it. Notably, the Tesla Model S Plaid and Model X Plaid are among the first electric vehicle models equipped with the 4680 battery cells. The Model S Plaid demonstrates improved performance, achieving a range of up to 520 miles, 837 km on a single charge, along with notable improvements in fast charging capabilities. Similarly, the Model X Plaid showcases can achieve an impressive range of up to 390 miles, approximately 628 kilometers, on a single charge, showcasing a substantial improvement in range compared to previous versions. Ford's electric pickup truck, the F-150 Lightning, also benefits from the 4680 battery technology. The use of 4680 cells enables the F-150 Lightning to tow heavy loads, and achieve longer driving ranges compared to previous iterations of the Ford F-150. 
Looking ahead, Tesla's upcoming Model Y Juniper is expected to leverage the 4680 battery cells, offering extended range, faster charging times, and improved efficiency. 2. M3P Battery Another potential battery option for the Model Y Juniper is the M3P battery, currently powering Tesla's high-performance Model 3, or the Model 3 Ludicrous. This power-packed battery variant is expected to inject a significant boost into the Juniper's capabilities, potentially extending the range by at least 20% towards an aspirational 300 miles. The M3P battery is renowned for its rapid charging capabilities, with Tesla citing a charging time from 10% to 80% in approximately 20 minutes when using a high-capacity Tesla supercharger station. This faster charging speed not only reduces charging times, but also alleviates range anxiety, catering to drivers seeking a more spirited driving experience with extended range capabilities. Tesla's competitors, like the Porsche Taycan, Audi e-tron GT, and Ford Mustang Mach-E GT all utilize high-performance battery systems similar to Tesla's M3P. Each of these electric vehicles delivers impressive acceleration and handling capabilities, with ranges ranging from 200 miles to 270 miles on a single charge. The Model Y Juniper, with its innovative M3P battery option, is poised to surpass the range capabilities of these models, potentially extending its range to compete with high-performance electric vehicles in its class. 3. CATL's Shenxing Plus EV Battery Last but not least, in collaboration with KATL, Tesla is at the forefront of developing cutting-edge battery technology for its upcoming Model Y Juniper, promising enhanced operational range and efficiency. CATL recently unveiled the world's first LFP battery capable of ultra-fast 4C charging delivering a range of 370 miles, 600 kilometers, in just 10 minutes, an impressive feat achieved with their new Shenxing Plus EV battery. This revolutionary battery is not only capable of fast charging, but also boasts an exceptional CLTC operating range, exceeding 620 miles, 1,000 kilometers, allowing for rapid recharging even at frigid temperatures as low as 20 degree, 40 degree to boost energy density, Cattle has introduced its proprietary 3D honeycomb material internally, resulting in the Shenxing Plus achieving an energy density of 205 watt-hour per kilogram, equivalent to most traditional NCM batteries. This advancement suggests that the perceived trade-off between cost and energy density with LFP batteries may soon be overturned. Moreover, CATL announced plans in January to reduce LFP battery costs by up to 50% per kilowatt hours by mid-2024, positioning LFP as a more cost-effective alternative. The advantages of LFP batteries, such as longer lifespan and faster charging capabilities akin to the M3P option, offer compelling prospects for the Model Y Juniper. Additionally, the lower production costs associated with LFP batteries could translate into a more competitive price point for the Juniper model. Before Project Juniper, Cattle's Shenxing Plus EV battery was adopted by prominent electric vehicle models from manufacturers like NEO and Xpeng. The NIO ES8 SUV equipped with Cattle's Shenxing Plus EV battery can achieve a range of up to 600 kilometers, about 373 miles, under WLTP conditions, an increase of approximately 100 kilometers, 62 miles, compared to previous versions with different battery technology. Similarly, the Xpeng P7 sedan, utilizing Cattle's Shenxing Plus EV battery, achieves an impressive driving range of up to 700 kilometers, 435 miles, under NEDC conditions, an increase of 200 kilometers, 124 miles, compared to previous models. How does the Tesla Model Y Juniper outperform the Chevy Bolt EUV in power and efficiency? In the 2025 EV battle between the Chevy Bolt EUV and the Tesla Model Y Juniper, one critical comparison lies in their battery capacities and efficiencies. Starting with the Chevrolet Bolt EUV, this electric vehicle offers a practical blend of fuel savings attributed to its robust regenerative braking technology. Equipped with a 200 horsepower powertrain and front wheel drive, it accelerates from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 7.1 seconds, impressive for its price range. 
The Bolt EUV comes standard with a 65.0 kWh battery pack, providing an estimated range of 247 miles, according to the EPA. It boasts a remarkable efficiency of 26.7 kWh per 100 miles in real-world driving tests, translating to a range of 265 miles on a single charge. Over time, with an estimated 1 ton 2% annual range loss, the Bolt EUV's range after 8 years is projected to be around 225 miles, making it competitive among electric SUVs. Turning to the Tesla Model Y Juniper, Tesla's electric SUV demonstrates higher energy consumption over the same distance compared to the Chevrolet Bolt EUV. The Model Y's performance credentials are compelling, with the current iteration achieving a 0 to 60 miles per hour sprint in 3.5 seconds and a top speed of 155 miles per hour, putting it among the fastest in its class. The Model Y Juniper performance variant is anticipated to achieve even quicker acceleration at 3.0 seconds, positioning Tesla in supercar territory. Tesla's WLTP driving range for the Model Y Juniper will be likely to range from 435 km to 533 km, about 282 miles to 331 miles, depending on the variant, showcasing its impressive driving capabilities. While specific drive unit details for the Model Y Juniper are not extensively disclosed by Tesla, leaked certification documents reveal 220 horsepower and 350 newton meters of torque with an estimated consumption rate of 15.5 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers in this comparison the model y juniper excels in performance metrics while the chevy bolt euv excels in certain areas such as range longevity and cost effectiveness the model y juniper's overall package offers a compelling value proposition for consumers seeking a blend of performance range and advanced technology in an electric SUV. Analyzing the data provided, the Tesla Model Y Juniper exhibits several advantages that position it favorably against the Chevy Bolt EUV in the 2025 EV battle. The Model Y Juniper's superior performance credentials, with a projected 0 to 60 miles per hour acceleration of 3.0 seconds for the performance variant, outpaces the Bolt EUV significantly. Additionally, the Model Y Juniper offers more impressive driving range. Despite higher energy consumption over the same distance compared to the Bolt EUV, the Model Y Juniper's efficiency metrics remain competitive. Moreover, Tesla's brand reputation for cutting-edge technology and continuous software updates further enhances the Model Y Juniper's appeal. Tesla's robust charging infrastructure and advanced autopilot capabilities contribute to a holistic ownership experience that resonates with tech-savvy consumers. How does Tesla Model Y Juniper's charging superiority provide a decisive advantage over the Chevy Bolt EUV? Starting with the Chevrolet Bolt EUV, this electric vehicle features a maximum fast charging capacity of 55 kilowatts, which is relatively slower compared to some competitors. To charge the Bolt EUV, drivers rely on networks like EVgo and ChargePoint. With a 55 kilowatts charging rate, the Bolt EUV can recharge from 10% to 80% in approximately one hour. On the other hand, the Tesla Model Y Juniper offers remarkable charging speed capabilities. Equipped with fast charging technology of up to 250 kilowatts, the Model Y Juniper can leverage Tesla's expansive supercharger network across the United States. With this rapid charging capability, the Model Y can charge from 10% to 80% in a notably shorter time frame, typically under 30 minutes. So that we can conclude, the Tesla Model Y Juniper decisively wins in this aspect due to Tesla's extensive supercharger network and the convenience of accessing charging stations through the Tesla mobile app. This combination of rapid charging speeds and accessible infrastructure enhances the overall ownership experience, addressing concerns about range anxiety and ensuring convenient charging options for Tesla owners. Which 2025 EV wins the value battle? In the 2025 EV battle between the Chevy Bolt EUV and the Tesla Model Y Juniper, pricing and value are critical factors that will determine the success of each electric vehicle. The Chevy Bolt EUV is positioned as a practical choice with a price tag of around $32,000. If GM can maintain this competitive pricing, 
the 2025 Bolt EUV stands to achieve even greater market success. Its affordability is likely to appeal to a broader audience looking to transition into electric vehicles. On the other hand, Tesla's Model Y Juniper's success will heavily rely on its pricing strategy. Tesla could secure a significant advantage by targeting a base price range of $37,000 to $38,000 for the Model Y Juniper. Despite potentially being priced higher than the Model 3 sedan, those interested in a compact SUV are likely to prioritize the vehicle's overall practicality and features over the price point. Comparatively, the Chevy Bolt EUV gains an immediate edge due to its expected lower price point than the Model Y Juniper. However, when considering the purchase of an electric vehicle, price is just one factor among many, isn't it? The true measure of value also lies in the power, capabilities and overall performance relative to the price tag. Which electric vehicle will emerge as the ultimate contender for 2025? That's the end of our deep dive today. Which features of the anticipated Model Y Juniper appeal to you the most? Affordability, design, performance, range or charging capabilities? And what's your final choice in the upcoming EV battle? Model Y Juniper or Chevy Bolt EUV? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you like what we've shared, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to Adam Tech for the latest updates on electric vehicles and automotive innovations. Stay tuned so you don't miss out on our future content.